Thank you for watching the Fitness Fuse channel. Please watch the ads in the description. In the picture of Paul Ellis' surface online cyber from Rick and Morris, the general public started to realize that bodybuilding has dermed bad problem. Rick and Morris' person live person in their electrolyte and bound cause the muscles to stay contracted. All serene out of pain. Oh my god. Before being carried off the stage like a stiff statue.
Yeah, I'll write them. Didn't you guys have a? Didn't you guys have a little? Uh, yeah, we just had it out again. And uh, yeah, man, he thinks he can actually handle me. You know, I mean, the guy's never been in a fight in his whole life. I mean, his his thing beat up women. And why is he in Thailand? You know, he likes. To this is everybody knows this. Well, everybody knows now, but um, yeah, man, you know, he actually we got into it. I don't know, two months ago. He said that he was drug free for the WBF. I, I, I was like, what? <laughs> he said that. I was like, what? I was like, what the fuck are you talking about, drug free? everybody in Arizona Zara nobody's working <coughs> you know mm -hmm. nobody had jobs John so what were they doing mm -hmm. think about it right John Dennis Tenorino did a year in jail because he was prostituting all the guys out he did the rap well I hate to say this he did the rap he you know he, he did the rap. Mm -hmm. you know uh, it was so crazy that you know then and I and that made me such more of an outcast, John. And you, you know, the first time I go to Gold's Gym in, in Venice, I just wanted to teenage America, and I want to go out and see how people train. So I go, and I, I, I notice, you know, behind the counter, they got this big, thick book of bodybuilders. And I remember looking through the book thinking, what is this for? Well, what was going on is people were calling and, you know, picking who they wanted to. I mean, I'm talking like 300 people in a book. Mm -hmm. They call to see, you know, they want to order up a meal. I mean, <laughs> it's not a meal, but, you know, right. ordering up, I, I guess, ordering up some right. I don't know. Right. But. <laughs> oh, uh, Time where Joe Weeder was sitting in the audience and he he literally summoned you up off the stage and said, "Listen, I'll send you to Arnold's doctor to take care of your calves." Remember telling me that? Yeah, he is. Uh, you know, he is in a plastic surgeon. He told me, you know, I did Arnold's calves, and you know, I, I turned it down because I got too big of a mouth, and I was not I wasn't sick. Right. You know, you know, Mike. In, in, in an industry that's bent on illusion, it's good to talk to somebody who's not. <laughs> you know, it's rare. <laughs> hey, Dal. What a look at.
peeked out with myself and run in and gone down a little bit. Um, it's like, how do you, you know? Um, Dorian's chemist, you know, and, and um, honestly, he had me on 23 different drugs. 23? Yeah, well, you do. You know, it went for, for a 12 week cycle. You know, I when I dropped one thing, I'd add in another, and you know, taking EPO, and I was doing eight items a day at uh, Genotropin, which was the best growth I've ever used. Yeah, it was the real, the real deal. Remember the 36 shot you pay? Yeah. Well, yeah. Um, Eight of those a day, huh? Wow. Yeah, you know what? Um, and I competed at 252 pounds cut. Yeah, that was the biggest you know, ever. I always competed at 220. Yeah. You know, but, um, I, I, you know, I was very surprised when I read Dorian's story of muscular development about the drugs he took. Was he a liar? Yeah. Well, he lies about a lot of things. You know, he also thinks that the Holocaust didn't occur. You know, well, he, um, no, he didn't. Come on. You know, Dave. What was Dorian taking? You know, you didn't use this chemistry. He was doing what I was doing. Tell me, what, what, what were you taking? Oh, my God. Everything I did my hands on then. <laughs> I mean, the wherever European, the great, the best drugs, you know, Parabol and Finjet. Real one show V from veterinary sources. I mean, you know, the best of the best. Right. Right. No, sell air about. I mean, you know, just it was the top shit I used yet. Um, yeah. And some drugs I didn't even know what they were. 